Importing data. The import from a file button opens a dialog for data import. There you can select a file with the data to import into Forex Tester. Click on the field and navigate to the folder where the file containing the data is allocated. Click twice on the required file. Make sure that the currency in the Import to Symbol drop down menu is the same as the Select a File Import menu. Set the time zone. By default, the time zone is set to GMT plus zero time. To change it to New York time, for instance, please drag the scroll bar to the negative 5 value. If you want to delete previously imported historical data for this symbol, then enable the first checkbox. If you want to delete all the bars that appear on Saturdays and Sundays, then enable the second checkbox. After that, click Next. In the next window, you can adjust the data format. If you've downloaded the data from our official site, you do not need to make any adjustments. Just click the Import button. If you import the data from any other resource, then you have to make sure that the succession of parameters in your file correspond to the succession of the parameters in the Import History Data window. There are eight possible parameters for the data. Symbol, Date, Time, Open Price of the Bar, High Price, Low Price, Close Price, Volume. Your source file is displayed in the Source File field. In our example, the first parameter is the symbol name. That is why the value of the column 1 drop-down menu should also be symbol. The second parameter is the date. It is highly important to pick the right values for the column separator and the date format menus. In this example, all the values are separated with commas. However, in your custom file, they might be separated with a semicolon, space, or tab. If so, you have to select the necessary separation type in the column separator drop-down menu. If you click on the date format menu, you will notice various types. Ds stand for days, Ms stand for months, and finally Ys stand for years. There are many possible variations on the succession of these three parameters. In addition, the years can be made up of either two or four digits. In our example, the data starts with a four-digit year, followed with months and then days. Please pay attention to the no converting errors message. If you see this, then everything is set up correctly and you may proceed. If an error occurred, you will see the converting errors found, error colored in red. You will notice that Forex Tester will point to the problem with the question marks in some particular column of the preview results window. Thus, if you see that the issue is in the close column, consider changing the value of the corresponding menu. When all converting errors are fixed, you can click on the import button. After the progress bar reaches completion, you will see the data was imported successfully message.